And a warm, very welcome to chapter 5. There are a lot of, uh, a lot of people we can talk to now. So, I record this all in one path. So, the first will be a little bit longer. I knew you'd be back sooner or later. You missed a lot. Greetings, Vincent. Why are you here? I'm responsible for King Radovid's safety while he's in Temeria. We'd be deep in it if anything would have happened to him. Has Foltest returned? Yes. He's an old Vizima. Knowing whose orders we're following really boosted morale. I need to get into old Vizima. I stand a chance of getting in alone, but not with... Do you follow? What's going on? I have a job for you, Dandelion, regarding King Radovid. The Witcher's flapping tongue would be a liability. Why do I think you're up to something? It's true. I'm not suited to converse with kings. Done. Dandelion, wait for me at the king's camp. Geralt, do what you must. And we successfully abandoned Dandelion. Geralt? Let's go. So he got all my stuff. Away the army, you damned city guards! Good luck, Witcher. Oh, this is all. All right. Let's see if there's a little bit more. Our commander forbade us from joining the fight on either Mary side. I don't soldier. understand. Come in. Thank you, Geralt. Thanks again. The girl. Oh. How are the girls? They still speak of you. Shani and I have become friends. Good. I hope she's well. She treats the sick and wounded no matter their race. Not all look kindly on that. I see. Unfortunately, I haven't seen her since it all began. I'll try to find her. Farewell. Oh, please don't let her be dead. Hmm. This would be really gruesome. So, Widenian soldier, Widenian soldier, there's common... Actually, I want to do more. Take. I will wait. Oh well, there was nothing of them. Why I can use this thing here? Hmm, strange. All right, let's let's see. Let's look at the village burning. Let's look the village burn. Well, it's not actually a village. Wow, I can. F oh, Sultan. Ah, you're in time for quite a scrap. Looks quiet. Oh, quiet at the front. Here they clash, there they grunt and again. Oh, quiet at the front. Yea, even one. Almost all Vesima's non-humans took up arms. How'd that happen? When the Order started killing women and children, even the most assimilated elves rebelled. Dumbest move since the age of King Desmod. Maybe the Grand Master wanted to provoke non-humans. As if that wasn't enough, rumors surfaced about non-humans being resettled in Old Vesima because we're more susceptible to plague. Fucking fairy tale, of course. What are you doing here? We need to repel the attacking knights. Then I want to lead the civilians and Shani's patients out of Old Vesima. Shani's in Old Vesima? She's organized a kind of field hospital. She mentioned you. I'll try breaking through to her. All right, so we have to find her and help her. Fucking order of the fucking rules! I don't even know if I... So let's see what we have to do now. Uh, bu -bu 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 -bu. Sweet revenge, I must go to hunt down the salamander boss. Under the fire, I must get Shani out of hospital in old Vizima. We are going... We are... We're doing this first because, yeah, I like Shawnee. I like Shawnee a lot. So it would be really bad if I wouldn't try to save her. Wait, are they all coming? Wait, I don't even have to fight. I thought I had to fight. Farewell, nothing of use. So let's get to old Vizima. Let's see how this all fires up. <laughs> Good. Um, yeah. Oh, there it is. Chapter 5. 
Gracious sire, this is madness. You should not expose yourself to such danger. Wait here and allow me to summon a stronger force. Nonsense, Velorad. This is my city, the capital of my kingdom. Damn it, I rule this land, and I refuse to creep around its corners. Gracious sire! Silence! You know you might as well wipe your ass with those intelligence reports. I want to see it with my own eyes. Uh-oh. Non-humans attacking! Uh, protect the king! For freedom! Kill the dwarf! I'll hang you by your own guts, human! It's the Grand Master! We're saved! You return, sire. I trust you are not too late. Your kingdom is in need. You should know kings are never late, Jacques. Sire, flames engulf half the city, and the blood of your subjects fills the gutters. This is no time for word games. You must act. What do you propose? Allow me to command your army, and the freedom to do as I see fit. Never. Over my dead body. It was close this time. Next time, I might arrive too late to help. I've seen enough. Velorad, back to the castle. I don't like the Grand Master. I think he is behind all this. What is he doing here? He dropped in. He seems to have a talent for that. What shall I do with him? He'll come with us. I have a matter to discuss with him. Am I really that important? Well, yeah, I'm... this is the main character, so yeah. <laughs> Witcher of Rivia. Sire, I am honored. As I'm sure you surmised, I have not summoned you here out of whim. A serious matter weighs upon us. A curse binds my daughter. I want you to remove it. I have gathered all who might offer aid. Duet has been the princess's adjutant for the past half year. Velorad has known Ada since her childhood. And Triss Merigold is here for her extensive knowledge of magic and female intuition. Mm -hmm. Consult them and think upon this matter. We shall speak about it again soon. As you wish, your highness. In the meantime, equally urgent issues demand our attention. I'm listening, sire. Witcher, imagine returning home from an excursion against a monster, a Kikimor, for instance, only to discover your home a whorehouse. Your Highness. I'm not finished. Those you left in charge failed you. A traitor threatens to oust you from the home of your ancestors. Wouldn't you be angered? Would you not elect to shed more blood? Forgive me, sire, but we witchers don't meddle in politics. Yes, the famed neutrality. Alas, that is a luxury I cannot afford. Both sides chose my city as a battleground. Both will be duly punished. I understand, sire, but how can I help? You could start by being more enthusiastic about aiding a king. You could offer to slay whomever I choose. Forgive me, sire, but... Silence, witcher, before you say too much. Rulers don't enjoy being refused more than once. I'm certain you're right, sire. I must attend to some urgent matters. Speak with these excellent minds. Gain their insight. And don't forget my daughter, Witcher. I'm counting on you. I won't forget. My servant will summon you when I have more time. Hmm. No. Better not. I see. I must speak with Triss, Velowert, and Devet. And yes. we are going to do this, of course. Elite Royal Guard? Don't tangle with us! Don't tangle with us! Alright. So we start with... Twist. Geralt, I was worried about you. I worried too. I'm proud of you. Heard how you fought for Alvin. Horrible things are happening in Vizima. True, but the king has placed me under his, um, 
Protection. Tell me, where's Alvin? Uh, Alvin vanished into thin air one day, despite the amulet I gave him. Vanished? That's awful. He might be anywhere in time and space. I had hoped the amulet would block those abilities. I hope he'll be all right. Triss, I've been thinking about us. Oh, Geralt. Oh, come on! Do I really... Uh, uh, this is... Uh, uh, do, do I go all romantic and stuff like that, or... We shouldn't deceive ourselves. It's impossible. Oh, God. I... 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 <laughs> Oh, I, I ended here. I have to think about this really, really, really good. Alright, I think I made up my mind and I could guess that a lot of you won't like my choice I'm about to make, but I wet the glosser, so the thing where you can read about the characters and their selves. And then I um, thought about how I feel about this whole situation. And I've never got the feeling that Geralt was really in love with Twiss. And I didn't talk to her enough to really see that Geralt developed any bigger feelings to her for even though it's it were my decisions that he is is <laughs> that he is having sex with so many others just for funsies and that's not a good fundament for a relationship and but that's not the only reason i will decide how i decide uh, the other thing for my decision I'm about to make is that he he had death is at his back. I don't know how to describe it describe it other. And in most uh, in most movies it is like that that all all the ones that he will love are getting in danger. And I don't want to get Twiz in danger or anyone else, so yeah, I don't... In, in deep danger. I mean really deep danger. I think Dandelion and Zoltan are already in danger. I got Shawnee out of the way, kind of. And I personally like Shawnee more. And yeah. Well. I don't know if you understand what I was about. What I was saying because I stuttered a lot and couldn't really made up my mind for a long one. But yeah, I hope you understand and <sighs> let's just do this. Triss, we can't pretend this is possible here and now. We are who we are and neither of us wants to change. Mm -hmm. But I don't want to lose you. I didn't mean it that way. You're closer to me than anyone. I trust you completely. Geralt. But we both have things we must do. I don't expect you'd cast aside the interests of the Lodge. You're right. Believe me, Triss. I wish things were different. Geralt, hold me. Oh, this was so cute! I'm no longer regretting this decision. Geralt. What do you think about the situation with Ada? She's a Striga, Geralt. We both know that curses don't cast themselves. A Striga? Any theories? Years ago when you first removed the curse, you ordered the princess to wear a necklace with an inclusion. Juniper, broom, and hazel branches were to be burned in her chambers. Don't tell me. Someone replaced the necklace and added crap to the fire. Yes. Someone close to her who knew the secret. Velared might know something. So you think I should aid the king? Definitely. In a sense, I'm a political prisoner. I could teleport away, but that would be highly inappropriate, and I still have a few matters to settle here. Namely? I can't tell you. For the time being, my position is tenuous. 
If you help Foltis with the Striga, maybe you could vouch for me. I could resolve a few things and go free. How about it? If that's what you want, Triss. Thank you, Geralt. My endgame with Salamandra draws near. I know. I'd like to help you. How? Have you heard of Gnomic Armor? I'd need a skilled armorer to remake it. Someone with great knowledge of metals. Hmm. Kalkstein. He's an old Vizima. He's certainly not short on knowledge and would help you. Oh, I really achieved the neutral way up until this point as I was hoping to. I only know this because I read a little bit about what there are three kinds of armor I could get and it, I think the Kalkstein armor is the one where you are neutral. And yeah, I spoiled myself just a incy dincy tiny little bit and that was in the past. So it was about three years ago and I still remember that. Uh, whatsoever, I have a strange mind. What do you think happened to Alvin? Frankly, I never guessed he'd bypass the Dimeridium. That would be a feat for many sorcerers. Mm -hmm. Clearly, he has enough power to teleport himself anywhere, perhaps even through time. I've got to go. Geralt. There were so many options I could talk about and now there's almost nothing left? I've got... What? Uh, uh, Alright, I save it here and I see if there was something going wrong. I want to see if we really had only those options. So, see you in the next scene. Imbeciles. Alright, uh, it was nothing crucial at all because the options were already in there so he already talked about it without me clicking on them so nothing missed out of importance witcher count no titles please let us bury past misunderstandings in the name of a greater cause so be it Geralt farewell wait so Valorant knows her yes. signed the ch Oh, I know. I think the vet is the one. I think the vet is the one. Where's Valorant? I first want to talk yes. to Valorant. Valorant knows her since the childhood. Greetings, Geralt. Greetings, Valorant. I saw you uh, speaking with the king. I gather it was unpleasant. It could be worse. Geralt. The king told me about Ada. Dreadful, you warned us it might return. Uh, can you break the spell a second time? Hmm. Certainly, though I grow weary of aiding fools. Hmm, it's my job to tell you the streak was seen in old Vizima, but Privately. Make it quick. We'll speak privately later. Removing the princess's curse will be risky. True, but the king has ways of encouraging you to do it. We'll see. Do what you will. But remember, Foltes loves his daughter very much. I know. Geralt. Aren't you a bit afraid, Velorad? The king looked irate. At me? I'd watch what I say if I were you. Hmm. I've served Temeria all my life. If they condemn me, I'll hold my head high as I walk to the gallows. Farewell. Alright, good for you. So let's fuck up the vet. Geralt. The king wants me to lift the curse that holds Ada. Not surprising. You succeeded once, though it nearly cost you your life. The Striga's appearance possibly spells the end for Foltest. Many say he offended the gods. Remember how she first became a Striga? Hmm. 
I do, but I don't care much what people say. I'm interested in the present. Not surprising you succeeded once, though it nearly cost you your life. Appearance positive spell at the end of Remember how the first I do, but I don't care much what people say. I'm interested in the present. Then simply get rid of the Striga. The chance of removing the curse is minimal. I've heard a rumor of an additional reward for killing the Striga. I'm not interested in rumors. You should be. It's your choice, Witcher, but give it some thought. No. Farewell. I will not kill her. Interesting. Our merciful master will see you now, sir. Go upstairs to his chambers. I'll go immediately. Geralt. Don't you fear the king's anger, DeWitt? Wherever did you get that idea, Witcher? Foltest looked pretty pissed. He said something about bloodshed. Obviously, he spoke of the blood of traitors and non-humans. He might finally dispose of that failure, Velerad. Farewell. I don't trust you. I don't trust you one bit. So, let's go to the king. Yes? Get out of my way. Is this the right way? Yes? Am I going the right way? I don't know. I just go with it. Just save for safety. Ah, there he is. I rule a land of idiots. Yep, you are. Witcher. Your Highness. No need for titles. Speak freely. You've had time to think. What's the prognosis on removing the curse from my daughter? It's possible. Could the curse have returned by itself? Unlikely. Someone must have cast it again. Should you succeed, would... Would Ada's mind be that of a child? I don't believe so. She'd likely recall all that occurred before her transformation. You don't believe so? You're not making this any easier, Geralt. Do what you can to remove the curse. Failing that, you may slay her without fear of retribution from me. When I last gave you my trust, you did not disappoint me. Thank you, sire. Don't thank me yet. Should you learn who cast the curse, tell me and only me. If you succeed, I'll grant your every wish, within reason, of course. If you must slay her, do it quickly, cleanly. If you fail, and my daughter suffers, those dear to you will suffer too. I understand, sire. Good. Sire, another disease consumes your kingdom. What would that be, Witcher? I have been investigating an organization known as Salamandra. My daughter dealt with them, stupid girl. I regret I ever departed. To your credit, Venerad said you thinned their ranks considerably. I trust you shall finish the matter. Exactly my aim. One last matter, Witcher. Forgive me, but I had you followed. I received a report about your personal life. Your Highness. You must know that I hardly did this out of lewd curiosity. My spies report that you are romancing Merigold. I need to know if there is anything more to it. Trison, I wear clothes. That's none. That's no one's business but ours. Trison, Tris is a friend, and none of your concerns, sire. So, we made a, a vow for the Lady of the Lake that we shall not, that we shall not lie. And Triss and I are close, but we are not lovers. So, or are we not? I don't know. Triss is a friend and none of your concerns. I wouldn't lie with telling him that he's a friend, so... Triss is a friend, and none of your concern, sire. Friendship cannot exist between man and woman. Triss is beautiful, but remember that she is a sorceress. Ensure that she never entangles you in her intrigues. 
If you desire to go to Vizima, talk to my Chamberlain. I shall be away from the castle for some time. See Velorad about any other needs. So I shall. Farewell, sire. One more thing, Witcher. Yes, sire. This is, um, confidential. So you must pledge these words will not venture beyond these walls. I shall take them to the grave with me. My spies tell me you play poker. And, well, I have trouble finding worthy opponents at court. They fear I would have their heads if I lost. Care to play? Uh, not yet. I'm honored, sire, but I must pass. All right. I shall detain you no longer. Talk to my Chamberlain about transport to Vizima. Uh, all right. We did this. Mm, no, better not. But I'm going to reload just because I want to beat him and I can't speak to him again. So I will play with him. But that. I do off screen and if I win I show you what he's going to say but for now see you in the next scene